My recovery and keeping my MS in remission started almost 20 years ago in the kitchen when I started the MS Best Bed Diet that was created by my father, Dr. Ashton Embry, in 1995. I cannot stress how important this diet has been in keeping me healthy. I started the diet six weeks after I was diagnosed and never looked back. So, if you're 100% committed to MS Hope and controlling your MS without the use of drugs, you have to be committed to changing your diet. So what exactly is the MS Best Bet Diet? Well, at the bottom of this webpage, there's a downloadable PDF that will give you a detailed roadmap of the foods you need to totally eliminate, the foods you need to reduce, and the foods you can eat. But before you download the PDF, I'm gonna give you a brief overview of the diet. Let's get started with the foods you need to totally eliminate. Dairy products, foods that include gluten, legumes, foods with high sugar content, foods that cause an allergic reaction. And when you eliminate dairy products, I mean all dairy products. This includes milk and milk of all kinds, 1%, 2%, creamers, all of it's gotta go. All cheeses, yogurt, ice cream, and any product that has milk or milk ingredients on the label. Gotta check them all. Now I know this is gonna be challenging, but it can be done. And you may worry about your calcium levels, but we'll talk about supplements later. The second group of foods that you need to eliminate are any products with gluten in it. Now gluten is a protein that exists in grains like wheat, rye, spelt, and barley. And gluten is in countless products. Gluten is in products like breads, pastas, cakes, buns, salad dressing, granola bars, cookies, cereal, and crackers. All of these foods with gluten need to be eliminated. And you are literally going to have to check every label on the products you buy to make sure they are gluten free. Now, there are a number of products on the market now that are gluten free because they're made from grains like rice. But you're gonna have to check the label to make sure there's no milk or they're not high in sugar. Next on the elimination list is legumes. Now legumes include beans of all kinds, lentils, peanuts, peanut butter, and all soy products. Now when you're at the health food store, you'll see dairy alternatives, but these are mostly made from soy, and we don't consider that healthy in the MS Best Bet diet. You also need to eliminate foods with high sugar content. This includes soft drinks, candy, chocolate bars, desserts, and fruit juices with high sugar, like orange juice or apple juice. And now that you're checking the labels at the supermarket, you can't buy any product with sugar as the first, second, or third ingredient on the label. Finally, any foods that cause an allergic reaction need to be eliminated. To determine what foods you're allergic to, first monitor how you feel after you've eaten something. And I highly recommend that you set up an ELISA blood food allergy test with a naturopathic doctor. This test will help you determine what foods you're allergic to and was a huge help in helping me refine my diet and keeping me healthy. Now, there are a number of other foods that need to be reduced. Foods that need to be reduced include foods with saturated fat, foods with omega-6 polyunsaturated fat, non-gluten grains, alcohol. All right, here are the food groups that need to be reduced. Saturated fat. Saturated fat is found in all red meat. Now, red meat can be eaten, but I only eat it once a week and only lean cuts. Omega-6 polyunsaturated fats. Now, these fats are found in products like margarine and salad dressings. What I do is I use olive oil for my dressings and in my cooking. Non-glutinous grains. These grains include rice, corn, and oats. Now, non-glutinous grains can be eaten, but only in moderation, and you should really see how you feel. Personally, I avoid most grains altogether because when I eat them, I've got a little bit of a brain fog and I don't feel all that good. But if you're okay with them, in moderation, these should be fine. Alcohol. Now the Best Bet Diet doesn't recommend alcohol at all, but we all have our moments. So we recommend red wine if you are going to drink and try to avoid beer altogether. 
So those are the foods you need to eliminate and the foods you need to reduce. So you're probably asking yourself, what can I eat? No milk, no cheese, no bread, no beer? Well, here are the foods that we recommend on the MS Best Bet Diet and the foods that I've been eating since my diagnosis and I've been in remission. Low fat animal protein, fruits and vegetables, supplements. Low fat animal protein includes skinless chicken breast, fish of all kinds, and lean cuts of red meat. Personally, I'll have a serving of protein at every meal. I do this for energy, it also makes me feel full. Second, fruits and vegetables. There's literally no end to how many fruits and vegetables you can eat on a daily basis for this diet. Personally, I keep my fruit consumption fairly low and eat lots of vegetables, especially leafy greens. This is for fiber, carbohydrates, and micronutrients. Third, the MS Best Bed Diet recommends supplements. At the bottom of this webpage, there is a detailed PDF that will tell you all the supplements you need and the specific doses. However, there are four supplements that you need to take on a daily basis without question. That includes vitamin D, calcium magnesium, omega-3 essential fatty acids, and probiotics. These need to be taken every single day and the specific doses are on the downloadable PDF. So that's a brief overview of the MS Best Bed Diet that I've been following since my diagnosis in 1995. I understand that making these dietary changes is challenging and requires enormous dedication and energy. But I, and many others around the world, are living proof that it works. Once you commit to this diet, there's no going back. It's a commitment to a healthy way of living and a healthy way of eating and a healthy way to control your multiple sclerosis. Once again, all the information you need for the diet and for the supplements are in downloadable PDFs at the bottom of the webpage. This is MS Hope.